Hi, I'm Sean Gannon, and this is Minute Math, and today we're learning about how to multiply two whole numbers to find the product. Minute Math, Minute Math, when you need help you use Minute Math. We're given these two numbers, three digit numbers, 354 times 438, and we gotta multiply them. We're gonna use the traditional method here. I'm gonna start with my 354 up top here, and underneath it, 438, and we're gonna multiply that out. Start with the ones place here, like always, eight times a four is a 32, put a two here, carry the three. Eight times a five is a 40, plus three is a 43. Three, carry the four. Eight times three is 24, we add four to that, and we get a, well, 28, right there. Now, we dealt with the eights. Now we have to deal with the threes. Normally we put a zeros here, but you don't actually have to if you line everything up. It's up to you. I sometimes like to put a zero. Sometimes if I have it lined up, I just keep it blank and know it's a place value there. And I cross off the three and four, so I don't use that again on accident. Threes now here. Three times a four gives me a 12. Put a two right there in that place value. Make sure we're in the tens now. So it's 12, carry the one. 3 times 5 is a 15, plus 1 is a 16, 6, carry the 1. 3 times 3 is a 9, plus 1 is a 10. Right there. Now, scratch off the 1s, and we're going to deal with the last one here, the 100s place. So again, we're moving over one more. We don't have to write the zeros, so we keep it lined up. 4 times 4 is a 16. 6 goes here in the 100s place, carry the 1. 4 times 5 is a 20, plus 1 is a 21, 1 carry the 2, and 4 times 3 is a 12, plus the 2, gives me a 14, 14 right here. Now we have to add them all up, keeping our place size in line. We have 2 here, at the end by itself, 3 plus 2 gives me a 5, 8 plus 6 plus 6. Well, 6 plus 6 is a 12, plus an 8 is a 20. We put a 0 here, carry the 2. 2 plus 2 is 4, plus 0 is 4, plus 1 is 5. 1 plus 4 is a 5, and 1 by itself is a 1. And there we have it. We have our numbers, 354 times 438, multiply out to be a 155,052. It's a little separated there, but... If you want to see it again, 155052. A little easier to see there. And that is our final answer. I hope you learned something here on how to multiply two whole numbers to find the product, especially two three digit numbers. If you did, make sure you subscribe to our YouTube channel and like this video. This helps us make more of these free math lessons for you and for everyone else. So, as always, thanks for watching.